Okay, so quick tutorial on getting Google Lit Trips. First, you need to go to the Google Lit Trips site, which lives at googlelittrips.org, and you need to uh, sign up on the site. Once you sign up on the site, you can go to the GLT store. Okay, that G by clicking on that link to the GLT store, it will take you to this page in which you can request a Lit Trip. Once you put in your the web address, the uh, email address that you registered with. You choose one of the titles. In this case, we'll choose Bud Not Buddy. And request a lit trip. It takes a couple of minutes for it to get into your email. And they actually send it to you via email. Mine's not there yet, but we'll see. We'll take a look and see what happens. Once it gets into your email, it will deposit what is called a KML file. There's, a, there's what it looks like. It has a little Google Earth on it. It'll most likely have some kind of a, uh, it won't necessarily say in this case, this one's for Grapes of Wrath, but it'll have a .KML on it. Okay, that's the file you're gonna upload to Google Earth. To upload a KML file to Google Earth, and you don't need to know what a KML, a KML file is basically just the type of file that Google Earth reads, okay? So knowing specifically what that is, is not super important, just knowing that it works with Google Earth is, is great. What you're gonna do is, once you get into earth.google.com, it's, it's the online version of Google Earth, you're going to click on My Places. And under My Places, you're gonna import a KML file. And if it's on your Google Drive, open it from there, if not, just click on open file. Right there at the top of my documents is my KML file. I'm gonna open that up. And now here's my Grapes of Wrath lit trip in Google Earth. Okay, we start off in McAllister, Oklahoma. to the Joad's place, to Uncle John's place, to Salisaw, Oklahoma, and all the way we're traveling along. So what I'm gonna do right now is click on one of these information cards to get a balloon shot of what uh, is on here. And so I got a picture of the Joads beginning their journey. I've got a picture of Route 66. I have a little bit of, uh, of information on Route 66, and I can click this link to learn more about it. And so the idea is, behind Lit Trips is, is that you can use this as a teaching tool to take your students down that path. My preference is that you have kids creating these, okay? Create them in Tour Builder, create them in My Maps. Either one of those are worthy tools, right? But that step-by-step -step and stop-by-stop, -stop, they can tell a story based on geography. The great thing about having it in the online version of Google Earth is that you get you can also get current day photos of these areas along the way, which is pretty neat.